Hey guys, it's Andrew from County Line Adventures. We're finally at trapping season and we're about to set our first DP trap. I'm gonna swing around here and talk about it for a second. Okay, we got our first DP trap right off. There's a little trail that runs down there. You can see um, West Virginia this week. It's the first day we can set and uh, we're looking at anywhere from 60 to 80 degrees this uh, coming week, so. Not too excited about that, but we're gonna have a little bait here. Might, I don't know, it might be bad, but we'll see. We'll put it in there, some coon chow, and I'll spread some shellfish oil. Um, we got some big bottles of that too. So with that being said, um, we've got probably about 100 traps we can put out. We got about 40 DPs, and with it being so warm, we're just going to probably stick to the DPs, stick around the water source, and I'm going to say a prayer uh, before we start this season. Dear Lord, we thank you for all the blessings that you have given us. Thank you for giving us another day to come out here in the field in your uh, creation, and uh, I just ask for safety this season that you allow us to uh, catch a good number of animals um, that we would be able to quickly and safely catch them and just show respect to them and to your creation. We just thank you uh, Lord, for the blessing of being out here um, for my wife and family who is supportive and wants to learn and uh, comes out here with me and good friends as well we're thankful for them we just ask for a good uh season um or we just pray for some more properties some better opportunities that uh you know if we end up with one and more if we reach our goal of 100 or get more lord we will thank you and uh we just thank you for your power your love towards us and sending your son to die uh, for our sins and uh, we're gonna bait this first trap and uh Lord, just thank you for everything you've given us and bless this season in your name. Amen. All right, so we did stick that bait in there. We'll see if we catch anything with it. It might uh, they got some moisture or something in it. That was one of the things they'd gotten from uh, the dude up in Pennsylvania. So if this doesn't work, I can mix up some cat food and do all that kind of stuff. But I'll spread a little bit of shellfish oil. I think we got like gallons of this stuff. So might as well spread around and see what we can get. And see how many traps we can uh, get here set today. All right, we got locations two and three. Where's my finger at? There, and three right there. Um, I use some of this stuff. This stuff smells awesome. Truckload coon bait. I normally don't buy coon bait. I buy my own, but uh, I got this with all those DPs and five fifties from. I forget your name. I know he watches the video sometimes. Mercer's Burger Trapper Man, I call him. But anyway, that stuff there is pretty awesome. So we're going to set these two locations. Let that shellfish oil pop down it. We're going to put some of that right around the location and uh, traps two and three. All right, there's DP6 in. Down there's the water. Keep on putting them All in. All right, sorry about the wind. I definitely need to uh, start writing everything down, which I have a notebook, but I'm like losing my mind. I thought the first location I carried more than the six in, but so we're gonna see six traps of the first one is what I have recorded. And I, I put in hunt stand and then now I swear I carried six down and I can only find five. But then I walk down here and I find this. A little bit of beaver chewing spot I had not seen before. I don't know how fresh that is, but it is looks pretty fresh to me anyway. Um so I guess I'll be putting some beaver traps in here. Alright so yeah there's one one right here that trap is acting goofy that's a Z trap like I guess the dog's busted on it. I don't know what's happening. Almost just got thrown in the water because it was snapped on my fingers. But anyway, we got five in here, so we're up to 11 DP set. I don't know how it's going to go tonight, but you know, 
We'll try to get it as many well, out as we can. I knew I counted six. So, praise the Lord I found this. I'm always out here talking to him one way or another. Seeking him. Asking. So, thank you, Lord, for letting me find this. Um, yeah, at least I'm not losing my mind. <laughs> All right, y'all, this is crazy. Um, anyway, I'll get a final count when I get back to the truck in my notebook, but I just put three DPs and a 550, and I obviously ran out of daylight. So we'll see. We'll have about 20 traps on the ground to check tomorrow, and we'll just keep adding and adding and adding. All right, guys, made it back to the house. Uh, just to give a quick summary and some cool things uh, found out. So anyway, ended up getting 23 out. was nowhere near what I wanted, but, you know, it is what it is, so... 22 are dog proof uh, raccoon traps, and uh, I got one dirt hole set in. I'm going to add some more. Um, put a little thing out there on Facebook and uh, talk about some of your guesses on uh, how many we're going to find tomorrow when I check. Probably typical uh, catch rate is probably somewhere around 5%, maybe 10 at all. All depends where you're at, the weather, there's a lot that plays into it. So. 23 sets out it's probably just to get a couple it's probably a reasonable guess it's kind of a gay people that i'll uh, go over some of the comments and give those guys shout outs uh you should also have the kids do it as well before we get there though i'm going to spin around i don't have it uploaded on the phone or camera or anything i'm just going to take a video of the laptop screen which i know is super cheesy but there is some great uh and exciting news on here so i'll spin around and show you what we got all right, guys, there's a trail camera I had at one of the sets, and uh, that is a Tom Bobcat. We'll see here in the next video just how pretty he is, but he is beautiful. Here's the next one. Look at the spots on that guy for an eastern Bobcat, we don't really have much to brag about here in West Virginia. I mean, we have what we have, and that's what we trap, but... The spots on him are spectacular. It was supposed to be 15 seconds. I don't know why that was only two, but we got a red on there. Too. All right, we're going to move on to our guessing of the animals. We got Olivia up first. How many do you think we'll catch tomorrow? Three. Three? Good we guess. Mira now. How many are you thinking? I'm thinking probably um, like seven to like 12. Okay, well, can you pick one number? Seven. Seven. All right, Gina, what's your guess? I guess 10. 10. 10 or 12. All right, 10 or 12. All right, we're waiting on Aaliyah and Mom. They're working on her hair. I'm gonna look down at the screen here real quick for Facebook and uh, our guests as it came in on there. If you came in late, sorry about that, but thanks for guessing anyway. We got Kenny, he's guessing six, Kenny Cooper. And I would like to take a minute to thank uh, Kenny and Irene for all of their help and sharing the uh posts and trying to get some additional land i really do appreciate both of you guys um yeah that's a that's amazing guys thanks for being so helpful uh we got john briard sorry john probably mispronounced it he's got six nikki gezzi she's guessing three and we got nate at the budget sportsman Yes, a nine. I guess I'll say my guess. I'm gonna just go with a bang, and I'm gonna say 12, which is basically a 50% uh, catch rate, which is just would be ridiculous. Um, and we've had nothing like that since. You know, smaller numbers is a little bit easier. We had three last year, the first time we set them out, and we did catch three. So. You had a hundred percent catch rate, but if you put ten traps out, you know you probably still only would gotten three, maybe, maybe a few more. But anyway, so that is my guess. We're gonna go for a dozen, and we'll round out the video with Aaliyah and Marquia. And guys, thanks for watching, and we'll try to upload as many videos as we can. Hopefully, we'll be uh, getting a bunch of raccoons. We're gonna have some beaver uh, videos probably towards the middle of next week. It's a little more of a hike. And uh, hopefully we will get that bobcat. That would be amazing. So thanks, guys, for watching. We'll throw the last two guesses on there, and we'll see you on the next Lee's one. He's getting a little hair work done. So what's your guess, Lee? Said so anywhere from 0 to 23 is your options. 
but the lower is probably more likely, but whatever you want to guess. Uh, 29? Uh, lower than 23. 29 would be a fantastic miracle. Nine. Nine? All right. Thanks. We got Marquia for our final guess. I think we are going to get 13. Wow, that's the largest guess of them all, except for Aaliyah's impossible guess. So, all right, I went with 12. So, we'll see you on the next video. Come and watch and see if your guess is correct.